These are layer brown chickens, age 23 weeks, poor egg production performance. Suffer from respiratory symptoms from a week ago. The chickens infected by Laringa tracheitis virus, low feed intake. Daily mortality rate to increase. This chicken suffers from dyspnea, conjunctivitis. Lacrimation with ocular discharge laterally. Almost all chickens in the flock show respiratory symptoms, coughing, rails, dyspnea, some of which have lacrimation or ocular discharge. Some show a swollen face, swelling in the subocular area, sinusitis. It seems that bacterial infections also have a role in this problem. Some chickens look face cyanosis, lack of oxygen, chickens suffer greatly for breathing. Difficulty breathing, at first glance looks like asthma in humans. Severe cough, hoarseness, as seen choking and a lot of phlegm in the respiratory tract. And extension of the neck during inspiration. Chickens often wag their heads and a lot of phlegm that comes out of the oral cavity. Sometimes the sputum is mixed with blood. Many spots of bloody sputum were found attached to the battery cage wire, feed container, and on the floor. Sometimes still seen bloody sputum sticking to the nose, beak, face. For symptoms like this you can see clearly in our other video about laryngotracheitis on field. Vet channel. Please check out our other videos on the same topic. Look, this is what is happening to the chicken trachea. Severe hemorrhagic tracheitis, severe inflammation of the trachea. Blood mixed with tracheal exudates. Severe inflammation in the upper respiratory tract. The mortality rate can reach 10 to 25 percent, even more in the case of poor handling. Death occurs due to respiratory failure caused by respiratory tract obstruction by tracheal exudates. Handling of sick chicken in battery cage is not effective.
Chickens need a comfortable place, especially when they are sick. The mortality rate will increase in the chickens still in the battery cage, if they are sick. Remove them from the battery cage, put them in the quarantine house with the floor system. They need good air circulation, not overcrowding and access to good drinking water. Hopefully this video can be a discussion material for veterinary students, animal science students, farmers and professionals. Follow us please click subscribe button below to see our latest videos or support us with clicks, likes and share buttons. Thank you.